standing here with Brandy Gardner. She's a member of SiouxCountry.com. So, Brandy, how many shows have you emceed? It seems like every show I go to locally, you're always on stage. Um, you know what? I've lost count. I have actually emceed so many. I don't know. Quite a few, though. But you know what? They're all so different and unique, and I respect them all equally. Um, I've emceed um, pro shows right down to first-time shows, which is like today. It's a very first show for the Armed Forces, but this is their nationals, so it's a big deal for these guys, and um, this is their first year getting them off the ground, so next year will be even better for them. How would you say the turnout was for the show this year? I think it was good. I think the quality was very good, and um, I think considering where we're at with the economy, you know, it is great. Especially with the traveling and stuff. We've yes. had people travel from all over for the show. I, I heard somebody from Japan and yeah, all the way from Japan. people from, you know, Michigan, even Texas. That's expensive to travel. And on top of that, you know, you've got the suits and everything, posing music. That's not cheap. Yeah. So right down to your tanning and your the nails for the ladies and the hair and everything else. You know, there's a lot that goes into it. Just the same as it does for us nationally and um, locally. Um, you guys all know because you compete yourself. So just imagine having to travel across the globe, you know, it adds up. And like you were saying, this is kind of a first time show and there were some first time competitors yeah. here. And you were once in that position, but now you're a veteran of this and you earned your pro card. And how does it feel when they come to you for advice? And You know, it feels good. I'm still excited and still happy, but um, I'm also still so down to earth. I just tell it like it is. You know, I have no expectations and I don't know really what to expect. So, um, you know, so it'll be like starting over for me. So my first time with the big girls, I should say, not big as in size, <laughs> but you know, the top girls. So I'm excited about that. But um, yeah, I just tell them I'm honest with them. And um, honesty is the best policy. I don't sugarcoat anything. So if they ask me my opinion, I give it. And what does it mean to you, because you're still very active in all these local shows, what does it mean to you to be able to pass down the knowledge that you've, that you've gained from all this? What does it mean to you to be able to pass it down to some of these up-and-comers? You know, it doesn't mean a lot to me. It's just like, you know, mother of my two kids, so to speak. Um, you know, there's, there's a lot of reward in that at the end of the day. I'm excited to know that the people at the gym, sometimes they may not want to step on stage, but they do respect the fact, and they take a little bit of something, and they, met, they better their life and their body. So that right there goes a long way. Yeah. Thank you so much, Brandy. I appreciate it. This was a wrap for our show. We had a great time. Next year will be 100% better, and we salute these great competitors. I like the red one! <laughs>